The weather's taken a turn. <laughs> it's been a while since I wore a jumper. I'm still wearing my shorts though. Uh, anyway, so I'm at a good stage with this now. I'm happy with it. Uh, I've got good headroom, but it's, it's going to take me a while to get used to the presence above my head. But it's, uh, I mean, there's no, no fear of me hitting it. The other thing I had thought about too though was, let's say there was a piano hinge here. So when you could open it like a little drawer, a little box, or the way I was describing it to myself earlier was like the overhead storage bin in an airplane. Might make up a dummy for one of them and see how it pans out. expensive wood and I cut it the wrong direction. Thank you. I'm making too many mistakes today. I forgot to turn the camera on a couple of times did things when the camera wasn't working that I shouldn't have done. Now doing things that I shouldn't have done when the camera is working. So, do I pack up and go home? Or do I turn the camera off and stop worrying about that? Do the box properly? tray made up with the veins on a 15 degree angle to so that gravity can assist to keep the gear in there. I've got a temporary pin there. I'll put
put a chain on it so it can't come down far too far. And that's oh it does ah. Oh. at the back doesn't work. Shit. That's been glued up for a couple of days. I'm gonna shape it now. You'll see in a minute what it's for. I get my head around this now. Maybe this is too thick because it takes a fair bit of force to let it off. Although it's okay, I think. And then when I push the door up, it just automatically closes. Okay, I think this project is nearly done. Uh, a few bits and pieces I might do to it still, uh, just some tidy ups and uh, I still haven't filled all the drawers, so there'll be drawers to fill and little signs to write still. But the project's done more or less. I'm very happy with the result, I'm glad I did it. Uh, it was very frustrating at times, but in the end, I think I got a terrific product out of it. It's very handy. As I sort of predicted, I guess, um, the stairs will remain in the up position 99% of the time. So as the stairs, it's not that valuable. Um, the toolboxes underneath are what I'm most pleased about. But having said that, when I do need the stairs to get up into the mezzanine, it's way handier just to wind this down than it is to pull a step ladder off the wall and then not have it tall enough to be safe anyway so this is excellent it looks way cool in my garage that was another criteria 
it's probably the first thing I show off when people come visiting. The cool factor is quite high. It probably cost me around about $200 maybe. For mainly for the wood. Hinges, bolts, screws. Yeah, oh and um, pulleys and a new cable. I actually had the winch already from an old trailer. So that was sitting around doing nothing. So it's in, getting good use now. This was a three part series. I hope you saw the other two parts. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. It does help out on the algorithms. I think that's all I can say about it. Except for fiddling on little things. But I'll call this done. Move on to the next project.